What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of American Truck Simulator. We're back in the Joel Collins Roland 389. Uh, I tried the Oshkosh truck, the big old 6x6, but for some reason there's a red uh, outline underneath it, and I didn't want to drive that with the red outline underneath it. Obviously, the mod is broken and probably needs to be updated, so... We're going to stick with this truck for right now until probably the next episode. I'm going to switch it up a little bit. Maybe, I don't know, pick something else. Maybe the Mac R, the older Mac R, something like that. So this is going to Moab, Kiwit, Caterpillar AP1055F, 36,596 pounds. And all right. Put that away. Eh, the motor sounds decent. I don't know. There, there has to be something. I'm maybe I'm put it the positioning of the mods. Is wrong, possibly, because I can't think of anything else. Or maybe I just have in too many engine mods. That could also Turn be the case. Because right. I do have the Caterpillar 3408 package. I took out the Cummins package. Uh, there's a Cummins package on Steam. There's also a Caterpillar 3408 package, 3406 package. There's a bunch of them on Steam. I should have got a wide load uh, bumper thing. I recently purchased a uh, police simulator. Um, you're able to drive vehicles. When you first start out, you have it's you're a patrol officer walking around, giving uh, issuing tickets to cars that are parked, uh, did, using your radar gun, um, finding wanted people. But I I've played for about eight hours so far since I purchased it a couple days ago. On my first playthrough, I went through eight hours. And the game crashed one time. I went back to playing it, and then it was like three in the morning, and I was like, okay, I gotta go to bed. <clears throat> but, so I got, the, I got everything unlocked. It's early access, so they're still updating it. Um, but it seems... It's been on my wish list for a while. Turn left. Well, for probably like a month or so. Because I can't figure out 5M. I've been wanting to play 5M for a while. And I just... I just don't know how to do it correctly. Or you could play GTA 5 as a civilian or... If you apply to certain uh, groups, you can be a police officer, firefighter, EMS, pretty much do anything you want, but keep just as long as you uh, make sure that you're in a commu uh, community of people that also take it seriously and aren't just out shooting you like a normal GTA 5 game. Uh, they roleplay. I don't know. I've seen a lot of that stuff. I've always wanted to get into it. I just... I have GTA 5. I have a PC. I have 5M. But when it comes to modding it, there's so many different things you have to do. And I just don't know how to do that. And I don't want to 
get myself banned for Turn right. using mods in, in the game. I know it's a single player and you're supposed to... You're using it in single player. Or, yeah, not multi, not online. There we go. You're using the game on... You can use 5M on multiplayer. Play with other people, obviously, but you're not playing online. You can get yourself banned if you use mods in the normal online community. Uh, but this isn't a normal online thing. But since I don't know how to do that, I don't really want to mess with it. Uh, so there's that. So I got the patrol or the police simulator. And I finally leveled up to get to drive around the police vehicle because you have to level up. You gotta probably pay for play for about I don't know, two and a half, three hours before you can get a patrol car. Otherwise it's just walking around, like I said. But um I've leveled up straight on to the highest that you can get in that game without well up up until the early access like the top of the leveling up I don't know I can't figure out these words right now uh, I'm so all over the place right now so I've leveled up as high as you can go in the early access Game's like 20 bucks. Police simulator pat patrols something. I don't know. I have to look it up. But the, the driving is pretty bad. Like, your car will just start going left to right, left to right. And you'll just spin out. And there's... We're going to go through this truck stop thing. Oh, i got to stop, which is... Right here? Yeah. That's what it says. Go straight on. Okay, finding the new route. Recomputing. Where's it at? Is it right here? Can't see. Hold on. No, it's over there. over here. Get ready to turn left. Yeah, it's up here. Turn left. Just follow the signs. You'll figure it out. Okay. Looks like the Chivon flag over there. The C. If we were in Chicago, then I'm thinking the Chicago flag, but it looks like the chive. Except it's not green. What is it? 71,095 pounds. Our last load was heavier, but it was a big old generator. So we gotta go out probably, the, yeah, the same way we came in, I'm assuming. Wow, I'm way uh, in the other lane. stay in my lane without hitting any signs get ready to turn right turn right
that's just a glitch out with the every time we turn around a corner that mic i mean that mic that mirror jumps it's just a little bit but it jumps and i see it every single time So that uh, police simulator game, I really like it, but I hate the driving, like I said. Uh, you can use a controller, everything's like you think it would be. You go from minor accidents when you're an uh, officer that's walking around to driving around, getting major accidents, you gotta ask questions, you, you have to... Um, It'll show. It'll say like if you smell alcohol in your breath, you then you can do an alcohol DUI swab, uh, a blow test, or if you see that they look nervous or their like their eyes will be like lowered and like sleepy, um, you can check for drugs and marijuana's on there, but you can have up to an ounce. Anything more is, I believe it's arrestable or ticketable, one of the two, depending on what else they have, pocket knives, butterfly knives, stuff like that. So it's it's a really like in-depth game that can go places if the developers continue to make the game great. Most early access, some games stay in early access forever and then the developers give up and usually I don't like to pick up games like that that are in early access and that haven't been out for that long of a time or that or games that have been out for like six months but are still in early access uh, that makes me not want to buy it either but that title interested me and I said you know what 20 bucks is probably what I spend on games, on purchasing games for my phone, I need to stop doing that. I should. I could probably use it to buy another game. And so I, I told myself that little. I told myself that much. <laughs> that's a cool little. We still have that mod for the garage that's out in the middle of nowhere, and it has park your trucks there, you can pick up loads, you can park your trailer there, you can do a lot of stuff to your truck there, like it's a it's a shop, pretty much. I don't know if it works at 1.40 point whatever it is right now. I'll have to try that mod out again, or go to the website in which I purchased it from and see if they're updating that game. Or updating that mod. Or if you can get tickets for having. Never mind. I should say they should have a thing in this game where if you don't have an oversized load sign, which there's probably one on the very back of this vehicle, but if you don't have one on the front and back, then you can get a ticket for it. Maybe I'm asking for too much, but I mean Wyoming and Texas have been. Well, they announced Texas after Wyoming, but Wyoming has been uh, coming out for a while now. I thought, it, like I said, I thought it was going to come out with 1.40. It never came out. So maybe it'll come out with 1.41. Then they developed... Oh, look at that. A cat. I haven't drove... I think I drove the modded that modded truck that passed us that cat one time. Go straight on. 
believe that's something. Oh, there's a Mac over there. Um, I believe that was a Mac. I'm not sure. Keep right and then or, turn right. Yeah, I think it was a Mac Ultraliner. I'm not sure though. Um, because I still turn have right. Jazzy Cat's. I don't have his AI traffic pack in. Or some of the other ones, but I do have the classic trucks, classic truck mod pack or something like that, where it, the tr the it'll show older trucks like the Mac. I think that was a Mac. Uh, the cat. I don't think that's a. Obviously, no, it's not a classic truck pack, but I believe that's what you get with Jazzy Cat. I used to have like seven or eight mods that were Jazzy Cats, all traffic related. And then I took out most of them and I only have about two or three in now. I've also been trying to get into racing. I mean, I've done the Assetto Corsa, Corso, whatever it's called. I've done that with the steering wheel a long time ago, but if you don't practice a lot, it, it takes a lot of practicing because I don't know half of those courses. I know like Nuremberg Ring or whatever it's called, the big old humongous two, I don't know, three point something mile track. I know Laguna Seca, obviously I know all the round ones because, well, you don't really need to know them, you just need to turn left. Um, but I don't know, I know like two tracks on that whole Assetto Corsa game. And so I was trying to get into it and I probably played Assetto Corsa for probably like three hours with my steering wheel. And I got into some online races, and those are fun with certain groups. Like with everybody, there's people that'll crash you out and whatever. But I just have to practice more. It just takes a lot of practice in order to play with other people that constantly play online races. So it takes, it's going to take some time to learn lines and learn tracks and cars and which cars I want to use. I mean, I don't want to be able to, I don't want to learn all of them. I don't have all the DLCs, like I don't have the Porsche DLC, I don't have the f certain Ferrari 20th anniversary or something like that, 50th anniversary Ferrari pack, but... I do have some Ferraris, but Keep I don't know right how to drive most of them. Turn right. Turn right. Going too fast. Too fast. Too furious. Get ready to turn left. Turn left here. We had a... Turn left. I had an opportunity to drive the special transport, but I decided on no against that, because you just pull in and it's like having doubles. You have arrived at your destination. Uh oh. It's gonna have us go on the other side of that big old tractor. Yep. So we should probably back in. Well, that's the only thing I can do. So flashers on? Now they are.
concentration is real. Is there anybody over there? I didn't see anybody yet. Nope. Probably somebody in front of me, though. blaring in. I gotta cut that way sooner. To get around this building, probably still too late. Yeah. Too close to this side too. through the wall. Wow, this is a tough one. Just to get in here is tough. Then I gotta make it. Well, I have plenty of room. How close am I over there? Pretty close. Concentration is real right now. <laughs> Hold on, let me see where we're at. Yeah, I'm on a good line. I just gotta cut it some more and hope I don't cut it too much and get close to that garage. I saw. Saw. I thought I grandma sawed it. Alright, let's try this again. It looked like I was past it, but I wasn't. It looks like I'm gonna hit it now. Yes. Goodness. It'll be a half hour back in. should be past it. Yeah. Well, it's not even next to it. It's on the one over. Uh, let's see. Oh, 
don't have any room over here. I do have a little bit of room to go up, but not much. Yeah, I'm off. Well, no, it's blocked off right there. Super close. That's in there, but I don't like the way it's positioned. can't see because of the oversized load, but I'm just gonna hope. Ah, oh, wrong way. I hit the wall. Should have just left it where it was. <laughs> That was super tough. Let's drop it off, see what we got, see if we got late. Excellent, Caterpillar AP 1055F delivered from Farmington to Moab. 176 miles, five hours, nine minutes, felt like that. 37.2 gallons consumed. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode. If you liked it, leave a like. If you disliked it, leave a dislike, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends. I will see you guys next time. I might do one of those police simulator videos. See how that goes over. But we'll see. Have a great weekend. See you guys next time. I'm going on vacation. So I won't be probably uploading a video this Friday. Or the next Friday, should I say. Because this goes out on Friday. But the next Friday. So... I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Take care. Peace out.